So I understand the electric car piece of it and the propulsion system, uh, as you said, it could be a variety of things in the future. But could a McLaren ever be an autonomous vehicle? Huh. No, not a totally autonomous um, vehicle. Because again, it's an emotional product and people buy it to drive it. Okay? But there are other, other um, aspects to consider. One, um, there will be also requirements from the regulations. Mm -hmm. So some things we will have to offer. Um, if you think about an automatic cruise control, 10 years ago nobody thought about it. Today it's a standard and, and nobody is annoyed to, to have it on a McLaren. Okay? And the other thing is um, there will be also a customer requirement on some things. But I think autonomous driving is not something uh, McLaren should, th should think about. Uh, a couple of general questions. Uh, business models. You, you talked about being a business leader. And what, what business or whose business models outside of the automotive world do you look, do you look at for inspiration? Do you look to? L like business models? Mm -hmm. I think or business leaders? Uh, business leaders, uh, um, I have to be. Uh, I have to. Say, I have to say that I've been very lucky to work together with many business leaders in my career, which have been really an inspiration for me. And um, this is something um, I try to um, uh, get inspiration out of it and uh, to understand what is the positive things and what are the values these uh, leaders um, had. And then there are definitely some um, companies and uh, uh, industries that are doing a great job, especially if you talk about uh, luxury goods, um, how to create um, a demand, such an appetite to have something um, that you really can create something um, really unique and everybody wants to have it. You can look at watch industry, uh, fashion industry, uh, really fantastic examples. You're wearing a heck of a watch right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's uh, kind of the McLaren of watches. Yeah, exactly. It's uh, with our partner, Richard Marth. And uh, no, but they, for example, have done a fantastic job. They started with zero and, uh, and now it's really something super exceptional and everybody wants to have it. I want one of those. <laughs>